What is up, YouTube? Stiller Sideline. We're back at you with another different pickup this time. This is a Mel Day Monday pickup. I'm going to do two of them. We got two boxes here. This is uh, straight from the Pittsburgh Penguins vault. So this is a Penguins video. Been a while since I did a Penguins video on here. So here we go. Penguins video live on the Stiller Sideline channel. The Penguins Foundation has opened up the vault again. <clears throat> they did... Uh, Name play, locker room name plates, goal pucks, mystery game use pucks, uh, game use goal pucks, and the different items game used, and you were able to buy, uh, buy them on there for a limited time. So they finally shipped them out, and Penguins, you guys got to do better. When it comes to packaging, if you want to ever find out how to do the worst packaging, and take care of things the worst look no further than the pittsburgh penguins because they are terrible at shipping things out this is not the first time and it won't be the last time their mystery pucks are, people that get them signed they used to do mystery pucks all the time that were just signed by different players from the alumni or from the team current teams always have smudges smears they are not packaged they're just thrown in a box and here we got I got one puck. This is the box they send in. A medium express FedEx box. I paid an insane amount of money to be shipped uh, for one puck to be shipped in this box. Now I bought two different pucks, but I bought them at different times. So they sh charged me the shipping for each one and it's awful. I haven't even opened it up yet, but you know, let's not get into that too, too much. Let's, uh, let, you want to hear it? You want to hear it? Yeah, that's the puck just rolling around in there, basically. And look, look, wait, I haven't opened this yet. I have not opened this yet. I brought this to open it up with. Thought I would need my trusty. But let, 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 the penguins took good care of it. Look, it's barely even sealed. This this wasn't even pressed firmly down. It wasn't even sealed. So it barely had a seal on it. So we don't need that. We do got a piece of bubble wrap in here. Look, look how it is. Straight, just straight. Not wrapped in the puck and taped to make it so it's just straight and the puck's in there with it, scattered around. Anyway, that's enough of that. I'm sorry. I went on a rant and, and I apologize. I'm gonna grab this and we got, oh, and thank, thank you. Thank you. Um, this is my mystery puck. And you know, I, lo I looked at it and I didn't want a new puck. I wanted, I wanted one from the Stanley Cup season. And that is exactly what I got. I got February 8th, 2016 Anaheim game use puck. Vegas gold. I'll let you see it closer. Got the Penguins Foundation sticker on the back. So this is a game use puck from the Stanley Cup season 2016. So I'm very happy with that. Very happy. That is exactly what I wanted. I mean, I could have, you know, asked one for the, asked for one in the uh, finals. But uh, I mean, let's not be greedy. So I am definitely happy with this. I was just hoping I'd get one from the uh, from the Stanley Cup season. So 2016 at Pittsburgh, Anaheim at Pittsburgh, February 8th, 2016. This is just a game use puck. My next one will be my goal puck. So uh, you were able to uh, pick who you say you wanted to buy a Crosby goal puck, Malkin goal puck. You could pick who you wanted. But you didn't get to pick what goal it was. They had, so it's kind of like a mystery goal puck. You get to know who your goal scorer was going to be, but they picked what game it was. So you just picked, you just bought it and they picked it. So it's pretty cool. It's kind of like a mystery. Same with these. You didn't know what a game was going to be. This was pure mystery. There was just going to be a, a Penguins game. And I was hoping to get it from a Stanley Cup season. That's all I wanted. And I, I succeeded with that. So very happy with this one. And that's all. I'm not going to. And uh, not gonna go into too much more about that. That should be uh, 
should be about it with that. I hope you enjoyed this. If you guys did any of the mystery pucks or if you got anything shit from the uh, the penguins, let me know what you think in the comment below. Maybe I took my rant a little bit too far. But when I'm paying like an insane amount of money for shipping, come on, penguins. Don't just throw it in like this. Don't do that. Like, if you're going to do that, at least throw it in here, wrap it up nice and neat. You know, take care of it. Throw it in there. You know, throw it in a little box so it doesn't bang around as much. And if you're going to put it in a big box, you got to use more of this. Come on, that's like common, this is like common knowledge. Like, let me come in there and ship your items out. I do a lot of eBay shipping. I could do way better than what you guys are doing. Again, sorry, I went on another rant. You guys are hearing me on a rant there. But again, I'm happy with my puck. It came out nice. But look at the smears. There's some smearing on that Sharpie. And you know what? It's probably from not being taken care of. It's probably from it banging around however they're managing these pucks. Because they don't take great care of it. But anyway, I'm happy with my purchase. I'm just not happy with the shipping. But anyway, if you guys if you guys bought anything, let me know what you think in the comment section below. And excuse my rant. And as always, Steeler and Penguin Nation, make sure you guys like the like the video, comment in the comment section, smash that subscribe button. And as always, have a great day.